Hello friends. In this video, we are going to see an example. First of all, let's have a look at the example, which is example 20. A machine is used to cut and polish glasses. Push button is used to cut the glass, which takes 30 seconds by pressing and releasing. Then again, on pressing and releasing the same button for the second time, we will be able to polish the glass, which takes 20 seconds. Then a reset button will be used to reset the whole process. Let's head over to the OpenPLC editor and make the letter diagram for the given example. So first of all, I will create a new project and to do that, I will press Ctrl N. Then I'm going to press the new folder and try to create a new folder. Then I will name the folder as industrial example 20. Then I will select folder and press enter. Thereafter, I will change the language to letter diagram and press OK. I'll drag this down so that I may add the power rails one on the left side and one on the right side. And after I'm going to add some variables. My first variable will be start or a push button. And the type will be boolean. Then onto memory bit zero. memory bit 1 and reset and onto the cutter and polishing first of all I will add a contact I will try to create a push button here in my first rung And in series, I will add the normally close contact with a rest reset. And on the right side, I will add the coil with a rest M0. I will join the pins. My first rung is complete. Then on to my second rung. First of all, I will latch the memory bit zero here. Keeping the normally open contact. And I will add a block here from the standard function blocks, which is going to be the pulse timer. I'll increase the size join the pin and onto 
required, which is going to be the cutter. I will adjust the size and join the pins on both sides. Then I'm going to add the variable here. This time, 30 seconds, press OK and join the pin here. Then on to my third one, I will add The push button first, then in series, I'm going to add another contact, which is going to be the cutter. I will add it here while being normally close contact. I get it. Then on to the right side, I will add a coil with address M1. I will adjust the size, then I will join these pins here. Then, on to my last rung, I will start with the contact here, which is M1. I will let it first. Join these pins and in parallel, I will join or add another contact which is going to be normally open. And in series, I need another contact which will be normally closed. I will adjust the size I'll join these pins then onto my block here which is going to be the pulse timer Then I'm going to add the variable here, and time the preset timer to 20 seconds, and onto the coil with address polishing. I'll press OK. Adjust the size. Then join these pins here onto both sides. I will start the simulation now. The simulation is complete. I will click on the glasses here. So let me just show you the cutter and the polishing. As you can see, both of them are false now. Now, first of all, when I force through or when I push and release the push button, for the first time, the cutter is going to be on for 30 seconds or the preset time. You can see on the right side, that the cutter is true and you can see the preset time is 30 and the elapsed time is now 25, 26 and after 30 the cutter will go off. For second time when I push the push button and force it to false 
and release it, the polishing will be true up to the preset time, which is 20 seconds. And you can reset the process by pressing the preset. With this, our video ends here. Thank you for watching.